Hi guys, so today me and my sister are back for the second version of the video that we did, which was actually really kind of like spontaneous, don't you reckon? It was like, so fun though. Yeah, it was so much fun. It's very, like Shelby said in my previous one, very stereotypical video, but it is a lot of fun. Yeah. Like it's a lot of fun to kind of pair a fragrance with like a what do you, what stereotype yeah. of a person. Like a exactly. girl. Yeah. yeah. And if you don't know this, Shelby has a channel, a YouTube channel of her own, and she does all about mental health, positive sort of, what would you call it? Like <laughs> positive um, help and yeah. you know, like, just taking the stigma out of mental health issues. And there's not many channels like that on YouTube that do kind of openly talk about that sort of yeah. stuff. So definitely check out Shelby's Instagram and also her YouTube channel. And also guys, I want to tell you, I have a vlogging channel. I have to just like plug yes. all the channels right now. Yeah. Um, I have a vlogging channel that I'm just about to upload my first video and Shelby will be on my vlogging channel with me. We're going to do some like food stuff together, which I'm yeah. so excited for. Yeah. Like, we're going to do like maybe a cheat day video, like eating donuts and burgers. Yeah. And also you guys will know, like I'm going to do some like lifestyle stuff yeah. and just just vlogging in general just like a cool vlogging lifestyle channel so anyways that was a very long intro let's get yeah. into this video um so yeah we're going to be basically pairing a fragrance to a stereotype um yeah girl that's it <laughs> so the men's version that we did actually went really well and you guys seemed to really like it and we got requested to do it for a female version so let's get into it cool. what is the first fragrance or the first genre Okay, we'll do the first genre as Smart Girl. Smart Girl, okay. So, what do you think about this fragrance? And also, I quickly want to say, Shelby helped me with all of these. I didn't just pick these by myself. I made sure that Shelby... We agreed. Yeah, we agreed yeah. on all of them. <laughs> Sorry. The first one is Tom Ford's Shanghai Lily. Yeah, pull it back a bit. There you go. Yeah. Shanghai <laughs> Lily. I actually wore this yesterday. I love this one. So it seems very classy. Yeah, classy. A bit sweet. Yep. Very complex. Yes. It's Tom Ford. Yes. Yeah. It's a beautiful, expensive brand. We picked it for a smart girl because I feel like, obviously, intelligent, complex, tasteful, tasteful class, that all kind yeah. of goes into smart to me. So the next genre is yeah, no. the party girl. Now, this is Lancome's La Nuit Trésor. And. <laughs> oh, fruity. The pretty. Yeah, yeah, pretty for sure. Super girly. Yeah, super girly. Yeah. Okay, the reason that I picked this, do you know why? Why? Because I love this. I totally agree. Okay, the reason, girl. yeah, the reason is because oh. I wore this when I was 18. Like, in the 18, day. 19, <laughs> uh, se no, 17, 18, 19, I wore that. And I just, mm. that was all the party years. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so yeah, what do you think of it? Fruity, girly. Yeah, fruity, girly, sweet, floral. Yeah, very strong as well. It's ve yeah, it's really, really strong, but it's just like such, it yeah. seems like such a, it's beautiful and it is really nice, but it's also like kind of common smell. Like yes. it's common, sexy, yeah. fun Jeremy smell. as well. Yeah. <laughs> he says it's really common. <laughs> I know, you guys have the same taste. <laughs> no. Is he? No. Yeah, and it I is at my underwear. <laughs> Moving on to the next category, Shelby actually figured out this category, like she decided that yeah. we should put this in, and I think it's such a good category. Oh, come on, 2019. Yeah, 2019. Insta girl. Insta girl. To. They have their own stereotype now. This is Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess, and I could not agree more. Like, I literally picked it up, and she, Debbie was like, what one did you choose for that? And I was like, Insta girl, and she's like, oh my god, you're kidding me. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, she is spot on. <laughs> to me, that one is... Totally an Instagram, like Shelby said, bikini yeah. girl putting on her totally standard fun. bikini fragrance of bikini fragrance, bikini photo every yeah. single day. Yeah. That's it's gorgeous, right. but it is very Instagram girl. Yeah. It's very like it's it's just that real like um coconut oil, yes, pineapple, like bronze, cocktail, bronze yes. loving tan, hashtag loving tan sponsorship, Bondi Sands, you know what those are. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. So <laughs> hashtag bikini body, hashtag yeah, exactly. summer. Yeah, a hundred percent. So to me, that is SA Log Rods Goddess as well. Yeah. Amazing. So Instagram girl. Yes. I know there's a lot of you out there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so next up we have the quiet girl. Yes. Guys, this is beautiful. I yeah. love this. Do you really love it? Yeah. This is Daisy Dream from Marc Jacobs. I'm not going to lie. I'm not the biggest fan of Marc Jacobs fragrances at all, but that was like my first fragrance that yeah. I got. And I yeah. loved it. I loved it. I Definitely a more. quiet girl one. It's like a really simple, shy, yes. cutesy, introverted, like innocent scent. It's like, oh, that's really nice. I wonder who's wearing that. And she's yeah. sitting in the corner reading a book, like yeah. looking around, making sure no one's looking at her. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That I was love beautiful. It. It's like, it's just really like delicate and yeah. soft. Um, yeah, and 
it's quite a simple smell. I, I would think. agree with everything that Shelby said. There's no need to go into it. <laughs> no. Literally, that is perfect for that fragrance. Okay, so the next category that we have for a girl is the Tomboy. So this one is going to be hard to smell on a card. So this is Molecule 01. Do you know if Sam actually wears this? Can you smell it at all? You have to like pull it away. Otherwise it would just smell like alcohol. It's a really weird fragrance and that's the thing, like you won't be able to smell it. Hmm. Let's try it on my skin. Yeah, I you still won't be able to smell it. <laughs> I swear. Now, the only reason I think Demi picked this is because for tomboys, I would choose Aquadigio, Eros, yep. um, One Million, like the guys, typical guys ones for a tomboy girl, are just they just smell sexy. So I let Demi like kind of go to the tomboy. Yeah, the tomboy for me, I really think that Molecule One is a tomboy scent because it's a very weird, wacky. Yeah. Word. Um, hmm. You can't even smell it. Like you can't smell it on the skin. But trust me, like this is. I don't think you've ever experienced this before. No. You can smell it on everyone else. Like you can smell it all day. Can't smell it yourself. You just can't smell it on yourself. Wow. How weird is that? That's really weird. It's so <laughs> weird. Like I'll put that on. You actually complimented me on that like twice. What? Literally, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So it's a crazy fragrance like that. But to me, that definitely fits a tomboy for sure. Wow. Molecule 01. There we go. Okay, next category is the mom. Yeah. The mama. Yeah. So it's just like the smell that like you'd smell on someone pushing a pram through the park or yeah. at the gym putting their kid in crush. Like, yeah. You know, <laughs> at the gym putting your kid in crush. Yeah. So. So. Amouage. Uh, honor. This is called Honor. Beautiful. Yeah. Oh, my mums have so much honour. I know. They're it's so, so cute. Like, and the yeah. bottle to me looks like a mum as well, yeah. like white and gold. Oh, oh it's beautiful. Very yeah. classy. We had two options. What was the other one? Ooh. Chanel, oh. Chanel Gardenia. Yes. Yeah. But Shelby was like, no, I like that much honour. So. Yeah, it's just a little bit more like Calm. rounded off. Yeah. 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 Like it's not too in your face. But I just love it. It's like, it's quite um, floral. Yes. It's quite calming. It's a very like humble smell. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a good word. Mm -hmm. I love it as well. It yeah. is definitely floral. There's tuberose, gardenia, yeah. um, maybe jasmine. I'm not sure, but it's just like a big floral bouquet. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> to be honest, but it is beautiful and it's very familiar. Like I feel like you would you would definitely feel like that was you. Yeah, yeah, comfortable yeah. around that scent. Yeah. Okay. Next up, we have the emo girl. We chose this fragrance right here. Serge Luton. Oh, there you go. Serge Luton. This is Serge Luton's. I think it's pronounced. Chagui. 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 Chagui's really good at French, actually. Mm. You should go to Canada and replace one of me. I'm <laughs> not going to know anything that's going on there. Mm. What do you think? Mm. Beautiful. Très bien. Très bien. Très bien. <laughs> very good, very good. What do you think of it? Mm. Definitely, it's like a bit musky. Yeah. Mysterious. Mysterious. Smoky. Definitely. Yeah, it, it is smoky. You're right, it's yeah. got tobacco and honey. No, oh, there we yeah. go. So it's definitely, shall we, there you go. Yeah. Guessing all the notes again. Definitely think it's something I would wear on my emo face. Really? Oh yeah, yeah. shall we definitely have an emo face. Oh know? yeah, it was like short black hair, it was like scary. <laughs> really? I don't yeah. really remember that. Yeah, um, I think it was when you were like did full time ballet actually. Oh, and I was like working in the shop, like my hair dance shop, and I had like emo Oh yeah. Hair. Oh my god. Yeah. You've had so many phases, like Lady Gaga phase. <laughs> Yeah, I love that. Her. I love that face. I know. That was a great face. <laughs> that was a great time. I literally wore my Lady Gaga costume that was like mini and looked like a bloody G string to the yeah. concert. But this was when I was really young as well. Yeah. And she had like this full on like bleach blonde white like fringe. fringe. Yeah. It was amazing. Yeah. Oh, she suited it though. Yeah. Okay, so um oh. next up we have the gym girl. Gym girl! Gym girl. I try. Yeah. yeah. So this is Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue O Intense. Very standard. I feel like you guys should have just guessed that one. Um, oh, beautiful, mm. fresh, free, oh, love it. Yeah. Healthy, it smells yes. healthy. healthy. <laughs> it just smells healthy. That's the funniest way to describe perfume ever. It smells healthy. It smells you wear this. Healthy. That made me just drink it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay, guys, don't drink the perfume. Don't drink it. No. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I agree. Like, yeah, definitely. Like, you can just imagine like some like girl like running around the park, being like, mm, salad food. <laughs> Yum. Yeah, for That's sure. So good. It is fantastic fragrance. Yeah. Big compliment getter that one. Yeah. So, gym girl, dotting the bun on light blue. Yeah. All right. So next category, Shelby and I had a bit of a disagreement on what to call this category. Yes. I wanted to call it the thought, like you know, Thartman and Barbin, but Shelby didn't know what that means. No, I feel like so, I'm a bit old now. <laughs> you're a bit old, no. Yeah. So you guys, if you, um, I guess, are similar age to me, you'll know what a thought is. Um, I just call it a mistress, like someone 
kind of, we don't like, we don't want to use this word, like, S-L-U-T. We're not going to use that because it's a horrible word. It is a horrible word. It's also it's used. very, like, demoralizing. It is. It's disgusting. Yeah. And we just kind of mean the girls that aren't ready to settle down. They're ready to, like, play the field. There you go. Yeah. Girl, but it's fun. a girl player, but we're trying to figure out a word. I know. Oh, my God. We should have called this Girl About Town. A girl about there town. You go. Yeah. Yeah. There you so, go. That's better than hard. I must say, I was quite offended when Demi picked this because this is one of my favourite fragrances that I wear, and I'm not that person. I know, I know. So, I don't guys, know. it's Jimmy Choo. It's Jimmy Choo. It just smells to me like a girl about town that oh. just loves going out. Oh my gosh. And she just loves to party and have a good time in more ways than one. Like yeah. it is. It's yeah. sexy. It's very sexy. It is. And it's really intense as well, so it's quite. It's sweet, it's musky, mm -hmm. it's just really, really sexy, and like, honestly, yep. like I get so many comments, but you can't mm -hmm. wear too much, because if you get too close, people are like, very strong. Ooh, yeah. what is that? Yeah, yeah. even on the car, like, oh, so sweet. It's so strong, it's Jesus, it is very, very strong, but that was my choice. I also would have said, like, black opium could have uh, yes. been in that category, but I gave my bubble away, because <laughs> I don't wear it anymore. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, so our last category is mm. the mean girl mean girl yeah all the so, girls in that movie mean girl with Lindsay lohan would be wearing this fragrance yeah they'd be wearing this shoe too yeah they would like, ready to stab you <laughs> our fragrance obviously as you guys know is called good girl which i think is so like weird yeah like, good girl for a mean girl mm. anyways i don't see a good girl wearing this like i feel, no, I feel like they totally like effed up the name yeah it should have been bad girl yeah, like it should have been bad girl. yeah devil yeah smell of the devil yeah there's a just, fragrance from another brand called Good Girl Gone Bad, and that fragrance really smells like a good girl to me, and yeah. that fragrance should have been called Bad. Oh, there you go. <laughs> but this is, what's this smell like? So there's more, yeah, sweet, definitely, definitely sweet. Like, it's got vanilla, tonka, and also a floral vibe to yeah, it. Yeah, like, a bit of floral vibe. And there's also, like you said, um, there's actually cacao in there, so that's probably oh, even like Because yeah. there is a bit of a warmth to it as well. 100%. It's beautiful. But it's, I think it's pretty unique, but it's definitely a mean girl scent. <laughs> yeah. Oh, for sure. Like, if someone's, like, ready to, like, be nasty, she's like, yep, she's coming. <laughs> she can smell it. can smell the shoe. I love that. Yeah. <laughs> definitely. Okay. okay. So, that was it, you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video with my sister because it was really fun. Like, yeah. I actually really like doing a bit more of, like, different videos and yeah. not just, like, the basic top 10 and all that sort no. of stuff. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll have all of our social media linked down below. Um, please check out my vlogging channel. Yes. I just I just started it, so please yeah. check that Let's out. Let's go, guys. Yeah, and also Shelby's channel as well. Like, follow, subscribe. Like, follow, subscribe. <laughs> okay, thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you soon. Bye.